If you want to send movies or large videos from your Android phone to your iPhone, I'm going to show you the two best ways. One is wireless and another one is using cables. So it's completely free. Don't skip any part. Okay, first way, we are going to use the Google Drive. So first I will show you how you can copy the files using Google Drive. Here you can see on my iPhone, I have one video which is very large video I just show you the file size details here you can see it's 5.2 gigabytes of video it's a large video so mostly movies file or large video you can use this option it's very easy okay let's see so first on your Android phone you just need to install the Google Drive so first open the Google Drive and click here and select the google account so for me it's this one then click plus icon and upload and use photos or click here and it goes to the video or mobile i just click photos and for example i just select this video and save so it's going to upload it's preparing to upload okay files here you can see the video was uploading right now just wait until it's completely done now it's completely uploaded here you can see now take your iphone and just install the google drive app on your iphone and open the app and switch to the same account you upload the video on android phone for me this is a cone I just refresh the page yeah here you can see the video now just click these three dots and download you can also open the video and click download here now it starts downloading just wait until it is complete it will directly download it into your photos app okay it's done let's check that I just open photos app yeah here you can see the video so here you can see the video it was downloaded to the iphone photos app so this is very useful you just need to try this one in case if you don't have the internet connection and also you want the stable connection means let's see the second way using cables so for this process we are going to use the otg if your iphone charging port was lightning you need to use this lightning OTG if it is a micro USB you need to use this micro USB OTG in case it's USB-C you need this USB-C OTG okay for me it's USB-C for Android and lightning for iPhone and the second thing you need is a storage device you can use flash drive or card reader with the SD card so I'm going to use the flash drive I will give all this OTG link in the description if you want you can use that. So I just take this USB-C OTG and connect this flash drive into it. Now take your Android phone and just plug it on the charging port. If it's connected you are ready to go. In case if it doesn't show any pop up open settings and search bar and just type OTG and search and turn on this option. How you can see you can see the pop-up so now open files and here you can see OTG so I just open device storage and DCIM camera and just select this large video for now it's 610 megabytes but it literally transfer any file size and click these three dots you can choose copy or move it's completely your wish I just click copy and select the storage device and just paste or create a folder okay it's done now the movie or large video will transferred from Android phone to your external storage device now go back here and turn off this and just disconnect this 
and disconnect this USB-C OTG for me it's iPhone 11 so it's lightning OTG I just take this lightning OTG and just plug it to the flash drive and directly connect to your iPhone now just open files so here it will show your flash drive if it doesn't pop up just remove and flip this okay okay now it's came now just open that yeah here you can see the video now just long press and if you have two options copy or move i just click copy and back and on my iphone and i just open downloads and here long press and paste here you can see it's transferring just wait until it completes okay it's done now if you want to move this video to photos app long press again and share and scroll up and just click save video that's it so now just close and close the recent and unplug this setup so now it's disconnected from my phone let's see photos yeah here you can see the video the complete video so this is how we need to do i tested these two methods many times i usually use this method to transfer movies and large videos you can use this any of those option and if you want to know more videos about this file transferring watch this playlist